Welcome everyone, my name is Michael and today we're going to do another painting battle. Last week we did a battle between a flip cup and straight pour. Now I love, love flip cups. This straight pour was amazing, okay? It had a big fireball, there was no way it wasn't going to move on. So now we're going to do the straight pour against an open cup pour. And we're going to see which one you guys like and which one I like. Um, I will tell you that right before we started filming, I'm organizing the cups. And I started to think, how am I going to get through this? You know, in some kind of like flow. So... I'm going to do both pours at the same time. It's going to be madness. I might even talk through it. So I know that seems crazy. Let's jump right in. First, we're going to have to go through the colors because we need as much time to make this happen as possible. Okay, let's start off with a neon blue. Now we have light blue. This is a peacock teal. Next we have a brushed metal bronze. Now, let me stop for a second because these colors here, the teal and the bronze, um, I had asked a question, I was running out to the store and I said, anybody have colors they want to do? And Michelle over at Royal River Arts had suggested, you know, grab a teal, grab a bronze. So I said, okay, teal, bronze, got it, boom. Next we have gold and then deep yellow. Obviously, titanium white. And we also have our pillow base, which is the Artist Loft Level 1. Look, let's, let's try to get right into this. This is going to be crazy. I really, I, I have no idea. Okay, so here, let's set up our, here's our open cup right here. I'm going to move these paints over. And now I know you guys are thinking, oh, why aren't the colors just all in one cup? Well thing is I do different consistencies for different pours so this can this pour right here the open cup I use the 70 30 mix and it's it's little it's more of like my medium mix for the straight pour I'm going with the 80 20 because I need it to stick together and thicken up so that's exactly how we're running that I try to get these paints really really good here Whew, this can be tough the white's gonna be tough. Let's just give it a shot. Now we're gonna have to hold this like a straight cup. Straight pour. So let's just hope we don't mix the paints up, guys. This is gonna be very, very, very exciting. All right, here we go. Who wants to get this started? First, we're gonna throw down our pillow for our open cup. All right. It's in there. The little baby's in there. All right, that's nice. Now, here's our cup for our straight pour. Let's start off with, we don't have to go through the colors. We talked through them, so we're just gonna go in here. We got, or obviously I'm gonna talk to you about stuff. So here's the white. All right, now, do we move, do we move over like this? Ooh, let's go yellow. And since we went to yellow there, let's go some yellow here, guys. Right in the middle. All right, ooh, looks like an egg. All right, now, I wanna go, nope, this one. See, guys, that would've been a problem. Maybe we should go to music and try to focus. I think this is more fun. Let's, let's see what happens. If I decide to go to music, guys, I go to music. Then, you know, of course, what do we say? I'll see you on the other side. Let's see if we can speed this up. Yeah, I think uh, this is going to be fun. I want to put a little here. Wait, I do want to put a little bit here, okay? Just like that. Now, I have to say, I had a, an amazing night, okay? I got to see an artist that I love, 
and I'm just very excited. So I'm very excited to actually get to this pour. I'm gonna put a little bit of that bronze in there now. Okay. I should make that white deeper, but the bronze and the blue will be nice together anyway, so that it work that works out. Throw the gold in there too while we're right here. Throw some of that gold right in there. So we're ready right there. And we're gonna mirror that here. Just like that. Okay, whoop. I want to throw some light blue in there. I don't think we've gone with the, the neon yet, huh? Yeah, I don't think we've done the neon yet. But honestly, ooh, we almost made a mistake, guys. Woo! Woo, this might be crazy. But we're having fun. Okay, so like I was saying, had a great night, got to see a great artist. Um, so I'm very jazzed, very excited, okay? Throw some neon blue in here. And honestly, you know, one big thing that I learned tonight is that I honestly have to thank you guys. I, I have to thank you guys for making this possible. I mean, I know I'm creating the art, which we're all enjoying, I hope. But really, I, this channel would not be the channel it is, honestly, without you guys. You guys support me. I know you guys have jumped over to the other channel and supported me there. So I just have to say thank you guys. I love what I do. You guys know I love what I do. So, and I, I think you guys understand that. And I have fun. And honestly, as much as I do it for me, I'm doing it for you guys. It's just, I love it, okay? Let's get back focusing here. But I just wanted to say that. I really do appreciate you guys watching, honestly. This is gonna be crazy. I haven't even seen, think about it. This hasn't even come up yet. We're gonna try to get some cells coming up here. Is this pillow so thick that this, there is no cells coming up here? That is possible. I didn't pour that in there, did I? I really like this teal. Teal's very nice. Yeah, we're gonna get this going right now. Here we go, ready? There is nothing coming out of that pillow, huh? Wow, look at that. That's crazy. This is craziness. Ooh, this is fun. Hope you guys are enjoying this. I don't know, should I go to music? Should I not go to music? This is a lot of questions we have to ask ourselves. But let's keep going. All right, I'm gonna work on this cup just a little bit right here just to move things along. I keep forgetting about putting this nice bronze in there. Especially since I kind of want to pair that bronze with the teal at one point right next to each other. I haven't done that yet. I would like to. This straight cup has gotten so much love right now. Let's give some love to this, this sweet little baby. I'm gonna do the light blue and I would like to, I'm gonna do the bronze right next to the light blue. Oh, wow. I really flew that in there, huh? That was nice. Now, now I hear a little bit of the teal in that gold. And let's just rotate through the blues a little while we're right here. Give us a little bit of green maybe with this yellow. Let's see what happens later on. And hit it with this neon. Okay, now you've got stuff happening here. Yeah, that pillow is very thick. Woo! Did not see that happening. But you know what it is? We say it's fun. And it is. It's a lot of fun what we do. Wow. That was crazy. Here we go. Bronze next to the teal, finally. All right. Here we go. Here we go. I've been continuously putting this gold next to the bronze. So we have to continue with that. I think this straight cup is probably getting close to being done. I really like this, the white next to the light blue. I always feel like it gives you that cloud feel, sky feel. What do you guys think? You guys think that's that's the case here? Oh, we're finishing up with this deep yellow, so that's gone. 
We're, let's just rotate back through these colors again. We love the way that looked. Let's go that, we'll go with the bronze. I think we are gonna let this sit for just a minute because we really wanna give some love to that open cup. Make it a fair fight. Here you go, gold is gone. All right. Now, again, the teal, the white, the light blue. Let's finish that up. Nice. And the neon. Here we go. All right, guys, this is awesome. Um, I kind of want to give some more love over here, though. And we are going to give some love in a sec, because we're going we're gonna to torch this. Let's hit, let's hit this hard with some stuff right now, okay? I do want to get that bronze next to the teal again. And like there, we hit it with the gold. So I want to go with a little neon in that gold now. This is going to be crazy times, guys. Okay. So the experiment wasn't super crazy. I mean, we are trying our best to get this going. This is not this. This pillow right here is very thick. I'm telling you, it's super thick. And the straight cup is almost done. Here's our white right here. Our titanium white is now done. Put that away. Hit it with our last of our teal here. That's a big, big spot of teal. We'll put that away. Still have a little bit of bronze. That's nice. And honestly, I have a little bit of that teal left. Let's just go teal, bronze, teal. All right, straight cup is done. Let's just sit for a second. Let's work on this. Here we go. Let's work on this. All right, we wanna torch a little. Let's see what's underneath this. Here we go, guys. Let's see what's underneath this one. All right, all right. You know, I didn't use any silicone in this either. So we'll see what happens. I was trying to go no silicone on both. So, and I, I, this is a slightly bigger cup than I would really use. So maybe this wasn't such a fair fight for the open cup today. So we'll see, it's not over yet. We still have to tilt. So let's see what happens. Ah, still making huge messes on my hands. How do you guys feel about gloves sometimes? Sometimes I consider going to them. I do make a mess. Oh, we all make messes. All right, here we go. Now that that pillow is finally going away, it's gonna, should pop up under the regular paints. I'm gonna overload it with that bronze. Ooh! There's gonna be a huge bronze layer right there. That's gonna be crazy, huge bronze layer. What was I thinking? Guys, if you could only see right now, I actually just rubbed this paint all over my face. That would be great if that was on camera. I would, I would love that. That really would be fantastic. Here we go. Now we're finishing this up. Oh, I, that's, that's straight pour again, guys. I'm looking at it from here. Ooh, he's looking pretty good. We're finishing this up. I can't wait to tilt this one, actually. We're gonna go right into, I think we should tilt this one. Should we let it sit or should we tilt this? Let's fill it up with some white right at the end. Ooh. You know what I'm gonna do, guys? This is the thinner teal. I'm gonna put that in the center. I had a little bit left. Before this finishes up, I'm gonna do something. Watch this. I'm gonna take this stick, I'm gonna wreck it now, so that I have cool designs later on, okay? I've kind of been, you guys have been watching, we've been doing hourglass pours. So this is kind of like the hourglass pour middle. That's what it looks like now, yeah. So that's cool. All right, okay, here we go, guys. So tilt this, or do this, this cup looks like it's staying pretty good. Let's just move her aside. Let's knock out that open cup first. Now we learned last week we poured all over the other canvas. A not all over, it wasn't so bad. But yeah, we did, we poured over the other canvas. So let's move this little baby around. There's a lot of paint. Here we go. Get that moving. 
Let's torch. Let's torch again. Ooh. All right. Oh, I stayed with you guys through that whole that whole thing. So that was fun. It wasn't so crazy as I thought. I actually moved slower than I, but I actually did move slower than I thought I would move. So there's a there's some cool bands of white cells happening here. But let's twist this. We're gonna come down a little. Okay, we're gonna twist this here. We're gonna twist it again. We're gonna have to lift up eventually. I do you want to move this over just a little bit? It is actually nice and fluid, so that's not too bad. This has a shot. Okay. This middle, I just want to make sure this middle is not too patterned. And we're going to come right up and fast. Boom. Got it. Up top, guys. Bam. We like making messes, right? Okay, here we go. Yeah, that middle is pretty cool. All right, let's tilt real fast. Here we go. Let's not... Pour on the other painting. I I think I've been favoring this bottom corner now for maybe the last few weeks. Let's keep going with that. We usually do that top, the top left, but now we know what do I always say? Oh, short distances, distance right here. Yep. Let's grab it while we're right here. I kind of want to clip it a little just to slow it down. Pretty. Okay, good. Oh, see, yeah, I do like the cells, cells up here. So we don't want to lose too much. This was not a, as I would consider, a, a traditional open cup by any means. So I don't know how fair of a fight this is. But it's almost looking like it's going to try to go toe-to-toe -to -toe as, as some kind of ring pour hybrid <laughs> with this straight cup. So... I mean, let it, we'll let it sit, we'll let it develop. But honestly, I, I feel bad. I did not do, again, like I should consider that traditional type with the big cells. Sometimes you need to add that silicone in. Actually, really, I kind of like this composition and I actually am digging the colors. I mean, there's some cool stuff going on here. Probably if I move this around enough, it's gonna generate some action and generate some sh some nice cells. I, I do see, I really like the colors though, a lot. Oh, I really like it. I actually like this composition a lot, guys. I'm gonna put this baby to the side. All right, we're gonna come back and let's work on the straight pour now. All right, here we go. Okay, I'm just cleaning up real fast. Just the hands, you know, they get really crazy dirty. And while it's sitting over here, let's do a quick uh, torch. See if we can grab a couple more cells while it sits. Okay. I probably actually should have torched a little before I took it, but it's okay. Here we go. Oh, that, I really love the colors in this. So, ooh, yikes. Okay, here we go. Let's move. Let's move this into our frame here for you guys, and let's have some fun with this straight cup. Right. Now I do like pouring straight cups into pillows. Okay. And now we know, oh boy, we forgot how thick that pillow was. Let's put that pillow away. I love these colors. Great choice. Fantastic choice. Okay. Let's see how it plays out though. I love these colors here too. Here we go. Ready? Let's go. Yeah, we're gonna, oh, actually I was very focused there. I'm gonna start rotating just slightly here. I see some great blue coming down, ready? And as that comes down, we are gonna thicken that out and we're gonna rotate it. And we're try. let's try to do that again, guys. Look at this, oh, these colors. Ooh. Oh, it's beautiful. Wow, look at this yellow coming right at the end. And here we go, ready? Actually, guys, that was actually, I did not plan that yellow like that. I know I put them that yellow like that. I know I put the yellow there, but I did not plan that to come out where that came out. Again, very beautiful cup. 
Love it. Maybe I'm starting to really like uh, straight pours. I guess let's see. Let's tilt first before I get too excited. So let's slow her down a bit. We know not to go over that part again. I don't like that, that this canvas seems like it's um, uneven. I, I've measured. I mean, I, um, I I checked everything before beforehand to make sure it was level. So I don't, I'm not enjoying the fact that everything's going that way. I don't know why. I actually will come up with the thumbtack underneath to keep that from happening. It does look like it's going that way. All right, here we go. We're gonna have to move this a little bit more to the side. Here we go. Ooh, yikes. All right, here we go. Ooh, let's do some tilting. Let's stretch that out just a little. The bronze is pretty. The bronze with the teal and the gold. I can see the fingers coming up, the little fingerlings coming up down, down below. Down in this corner. It's very nice. I want to see if we can keep that tail going. It's not going to be a fireball. I don't think it's punched up enough. I think I'm going to come do a hard pour. Ready? Bam. Let's bring it right back. It's not going to be fireball. It's going to look cool though. Let's do a hook this way. We're going to hook her right in. Hook that baby in. And I'm going to clip it just a little, just so it doesn't pour off as much. All right, guys. All right. Now we're going to stretch her down to the bottom. Let's bring that baby down and get these fingerlings going. Hmm. That looks cool. The fingerlings down there. I can't. I hope they develop a little. Oh, boy. Are we going to have another tough choice? I don't know. They actually have some similarities only because I feel like that again I'm gonna say it that open cup not not traditional what I would like but unless it's really cool all right guys it is like super late I have to tell you right now I'm probably not as loud as I usually might be because it's very late right now wow these pores are kind of it's cool that bronze is cool Oh, guys, I love this. Oh, come on. With the straight pours. Are you kidding me? I like this one again, too. And I like the composition. And I like that I'm able to drag this down a little more. And I like these rings. Whew. I just said a bunch of stuff that I liked. So that's scary. Okay, let's put her down. Because I love the composition. Let's put the composition there. Boom, one there. Let's bring her back in. I am not torching the straight pour. And we're gonna bring that one back in so it's in frame. A little better. I have the backs taped up so it's okay that I'm touching the bottoms as much as I am. Okay. Put them next to each other so you guys can see side by side. Wow, okay, all right. All right guys, what, what, what are you guys going with? Which one, which one do you guys like? Do you like the straight pour? You like the open cup pour? The colors, I love these colors. They're so pretty, so different than what I would usually do. I love them. Okay, have a great night and I'll see you later.